Here's where a daughter shows her mother that reincarnation is real. Lisa is an Australian and oh, some time ago she lost her first daughter. The girl was only three months old when she passed away. And of course Lisa was heartbroken. But later she realized that she had repaid karma with that soul, repaid karma of a certain kind, both with that soul and of her own. And so through this she learned to value life more than she did before. And then seven years later, she had a second daughter. Now, when she had her first baby, Lisa made up a little song that she just sing to her, just singing it. And it was her own zany little song, so no one else would have known it. And then when her second daughter was about seven years old, for some reason, Lisa just simply began to sing the song. Her daughter ran up to her and said, Mommy, Mommy, that's the song you used to sing to me. Lisa had no idea what's going on, but so she just said, yes. You find with children sometimes the quickest explanation is simply yes or no. <laughs> sometimes when my daughter used to ask questions, Sometimes her mother would call on the phone and then her mother would talk to me for a long, long time. And then my daughter, of course, she couldn't hear what was going on. She wants to know what's going on. So finally, when I hang up, she says, what'd she say, Daddy? I said, she said yes. <laughs> And my poor daughter used to look away so puzzled. She says, he's pulling my leg again. <laughs> but she had her answer. <laughs> well, Lisa remembered then, or realized at that moment, there was no death. There was only reincarnation. And all this happened, of course, before she was an Ekin car. And she also remembered that when she was a child, another Ek master would come to her, the Ek master Gopal Das. And he used to bring a golden ball, and they'd play with it together. So she had her own remembrances of the Ek masters way back when, when she was just a little one. <laughs> <laughs>